Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today. It's the Weather Extreme video, the morning edition. This is for Tuesday, the 14th of April. I'm James Spann. Alabama's weather stays nice, quiet, calm, dry through Thursday. Maybe a little light rain Friday. Better chance of rain toward the end of the weekend. Check it out. There's the upper look this morning. Got a zonal flow and pretty dry air mass across the region. And yeah, I'm seeing some 30s on that board this morning. 38 for Coleman, 39 for Haleyville. We think tomorrow and Wednesday morning will be colder with the chance of a freeze for some of the colder pockets and a lot of frost on those two mornings. This morning, freeze warnings in effect from the Texas Panhandle to Kentucky, Ohio. Got the frost advisories or a freeze watch, I should say, down into Tennessee. That's for tomorrow morning. There's the severe weather outlook today. Maybe some severe storms around the region from Tallahassee over to Jacksonville with a surface boundary down there. Tomorrow, a marginal risk over the Florida Peninsula. And on day three, Thursday, no severe weather expected across the country and probably not much thunder. Here's the rain for the next seven days. Heavier totals over North Florida, that yellow circle, that's over four inches. Alabama, most spots around an inch. Probably see a more substantial rain event again as the weekend wraps up. Model fans, let's go. Here's the GFS. This is the OZ run at 4 o'clock today, troughing to the north. Cool, dry day today. Partly sunny with a high between 60 and 65. Keep in mind, we ought to be in the mid-70s this time of the year. Tomorrow, we start the day down in the 30s. And again, colder pockets could see a freeze, a lot of frost elsewhere. Sunny day, and again, low to mid-60s. Thursday, same thing. We'll be in the 30s to start the day. The sky bright and sunny, the high close to 70. And then Friday, a little disturbance comes through, but boy, there's not going to be much moisture. Uh, there could be some patchy light rain, may mainly for the southern half of the state, but probably not much. Saturday, that wave is on by. Should be a sunny day, the high close to, I will say, 65 to 70. And then Sunday, the next wave comes in. Uh, clouds will likely increase. This is Sunday night, and this run suggesting the better chance of rain with this feature over the southern half of the state. We've seen other runs with the rain shield up to the Tennessee state line. We'll still mention a chance of rain here Sunday night. And then Monday, that wave is on by. Monday should be partly sunny with a high in the 70s. And this is a week from today, Tuesday the 21st. Heights are coming up. That means it should be warmer. And that looks warm and dry with a high close to 80. We've got 10 days, Thursday of next week, the 23rd. Troughing coming through, and that looks like it could be wet, maybe toward the end of next week. Here's the rain for Birmingham off the European Ensemble, the mean between 2 and 3 inches over the next 15 days. And after this cool snap, highs go back to around 80 next week. And this is the CPC outlook, April 21st through the 27th, showing temperatures here a little above average. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this morning. We'll have notes in the blog. The next video here by 4 o'clock this afternoon. If you can, catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and God bless. AS Heating and Air, the team ensuring your comfort.